The U.S. State Department has notified Congress that it's approved the potential sale of 280 air-to-air missiles to Saudi Arabia, valued at over $650 million. The deal would mark the first major arms sale to the Gulf Kingdom under the Biden administration. It comes months after President Biden announced the U.S. was ending support for the Saudi-led military offensive in Yemen. The Dutch Supreme Court has overturned a record $50 billion penalty that Moscow was ordered to pay shareholders of the former Russian oil and gas giant Yukos. The decision extends the 16-year-long battle over the breakup of the company. Shareholders claim Yukos was illegally expropriated by the Kremlin following the 2003 arrest of its CEO, who was a fierce critic of President Vladimir Putin. And British Airways owner IAG has narrowed its third quarter losses thanks to the lifting of travel restrictions. The airline group lost $664 million in the three-month period, down from a loss of more than $2 billion last year. But IAG still expects to lose $3.5 billion in 2021 before returning to profit the following year.